Dozens of pumpkin-flavored foods have popped up over the years, but the giant pumpkin weigh-in has been a staple from the very beginning. In 1903, Mayor George Haswell put a harvest display in front of his shop on Main Street. Most of the farmers, the only time they came into Circleville was to pay their taxes, and he wanted to improve the image of the town and invite the people to come in and get the city and the, and the country people together. It worked, so other merchants joined in the next year. There were several different names tossed around, and the pumpkin show is the one that won. The show did double duty as the county fair until they finally split in 1945. It only paused four times, once during World War I and for three years during World War II. The first queen was crowned in 1933, and by the show's 75th year, it was being called the greatest free show on earth. With more than 300,000 visitors, it also claims to be the sixth largest festival in the country. Lindy's Bakery has been making the famous pumpkin donuts since the mid-60s and for years held the record for the world's largest pumpkin pie in its own specially made pan. That started in 1952. Um, one of his suppliers said, you really ought to do a big pie or something. They still sell hundreds of regular size pies every year. The 104th show is making its own history through Saturday. Marshall McPeak, NBC4.